Welcome to another episode of Foodie Ands. I am so excited because I'm in Leeds today where I'm going to be doing a food review for Twisted CFB. And that stands for Twisted Cardigan Fish Bar. We are in L6 in Cardigan Road and I'm going to be doing a food review for their Twisted menu which is only exclusively available on a Sundays. And my gosh, they do everything. Masala fish bites, fish and chips, Nagadonna, oh my gosh, the list is endless. I have been given an exclusive invite to try out their exclusive twisted items on this Sunday. I'm so excited for this. Get your jewel buckets ready because we're about to go in. have a Bombay street food as well they do actually do this every single day so you can get some of your favorite street foods as well in cardigan fish bar as well and also the mo most important thing as well is that it's all halal as well everything is cooked on vegetable oil and all of their meat products is halal as well just a reminder Monday to Saturday they do a standard fish bar menu with the regular fish and chips and the regular fish and chips items but on a Sunday it is known as Twisted CFB all these unique Desi items and Jamaican slash Asian influence fish and chips this is really really unique we are going to be trying all sorts of dishes it's going to be an absolute madness we've got a twisted box which has got masala fish bites and nagadonna fish and chips all sorts of bits and bobs and then we've also got a special foiled fish which has been marinated a haddock piece which is marinated with jamaican jerk spices and desi spices as well so i really look forward to that as well we've got some pine chips and we've got to chuck in a few other bits and bobs there get your jewel buckets ready right so we have got here the jerk chicken this is on the menus every occasional sundays and look at that. So we've got some rice and peas, jerk chicken. And uh, what sauce is that? Gravy sauce. Gravy yeah. sauce jerk, as well. Jerk gravy. Jerk gravy. Ooh, get your jewel buckets ready. Look, I want to try some of the rice and peas first. Let's get a close up of that cameraman mo. Try the go, yeah. It's really going to just try That is so delicious. The first, the first thing I can taste straight away is the coconut milk. It's really smooth, it's very subtle. I've got a bit of chili sauce on the top there, and it's got that nice little spicy kick on the side as well. A nice combination of flavors. The rice is cooked beautifully as well. The beans are nice and soft as well on the inside. That is absolutely gorgeous. That is probably arguably some of the best rice and peas I've had. And in my previous reviews, I have done rice and peas, but this is this is proper stuff. This is made with some love, man. <laughs> I'm gonna give it another try. The chicken just falls off the bone. That is really soft and tender. Let's give it a try with some of the chili sauce, some rice and beans. Here we go, Bismillah. That is absolutely delicious. The chicken is so soft, really juicy and tender. Mm. The flavors of the Jamaican jerk chicken is beautiful. That is really, really tasty. It's marinated beautifully. The flavors are fresh. And the chicken is just cooked so well. It's so juicy as well. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got ourselves another Jewel bucket certified item. That is banging. So now we've got the cardigan king burger. This has got the toasted tea cake. We've got some stir fried donna, and we've got American cheese with a beef patty. Wow, wow, wow. And look at that. So we've got the Cardigan King Burger. Really excited to try this out. Let's give it, let's give it a try. Let's move back. Got the box, uh, my the toasted tea cake. It's got that nice crispy outer coating. Nice little crunch, but then it's nice and soft. Biting into that juicy beef patty. The stir fry donna is nicely flavored. The donna's cooked beautifully. I love the acidity of the onions. 
This is very, very fresh, very unique. That is absolutely gorgeous. And I am gonna drop that. That is draw bucket certified. And this is the foil fish. It is almost ready. Look at that beauty. This is haddock with the Jamaican slash Desi spices. The flavor, the smell is absolutely gorgeous. I can't wait to try this out. So this is the foiled grilled fish. This is haddock marinated in some Desi spices, Jamaican spice as well. We've got some vegetables and onions in there as well. We've got some rice and I believe that is some curry sauce into that as well. With some chili sauce, homemade chili sauce as well. This looks ridiculously tasty. I do not know why I'm wasting my time. Let's get stuck into this. Let's just hope it tastes beautiful as well. Here we go, let's give this a try. If you are a fan of fish, come down to Cardigan Fish Farm, Twisted CFB. Actually, they do this every single day. This is unbelievable. The flavor, is on some next level. I can taste those Jamaican herbs and spices. I can also taste the Desi side as well with a little bit of spicy kick as well. This is absolutely gorgeous. The fish is so flaky and soft, really juicy as well. I can taste a bit of the curry sauce as well, which is nice and warm. This is absolutely delicious. I want to try some of the fish, rice and vegetables. And we've got the homemade chili sauce into that as well. Let's give that a try as well. Wow. So every Sunday they have a curry available with some chips. This is the Lahori chicken masala. It has got a tamarind sauce, mint sauce, homemade chili sauce as well, garnished with coriander and some thick cut chips. This looks absolutely gorgeous. Lahori chicken masala. This looks so fresh. Very fragrant flavors coming over here. Let's give it a try. Got a nice chunky chip. Some of that Lahori chicken. Here we go. I absolutely love this. The Lahori chicken is cooked beautifully. It's really soft and tender on the inside. It's got beautiful flavors. It's not spicy, it's quite a medium flavor, but that is cooked with a lot of love. Home cooked style that is. The chips are nice and chunky. I can taste the crispy outer and it's got decent potato content in the inside. Actually not decent to be fair, it's got fantastic potato content in the inside. Really soft as well. The flavors of the sauce of the tamarind and the mint sauce and the chili gives it a nice and sweet and spicy flavor as well. It's a beautiful marriage of flavors in there. That from the is Jewel Bucket Certified. Yes, that is a hat trick now. We are on a flying start here. Um, this Lahori chicken and chips, this is definitely recommended. This is available every Sundays as well. They do one curry a week. So sometimes they even do meat curries as well, as well as the chicken as well. But today we've got Lahori chicken masala. What can I say? This is absolutely gorgeous. I am getting absolutely spoiled here. Right, so we're gonna try out now the mum's pakoras. The reason why it's called mum's pakora is because the owner's mum makes freshly made pakoras on a daily basis and they're ready to go fly out. Ready to go fly out on the fryer. So these pakoras are just vegetable pakoras with potatoes and lentils, and it's garnished with the tamarind sauce and the mint sauce and chili sauce. Garnish with also a bit of coriander. Let's give this a try. I've already had a little bite on the old TikTok. Um, it tasted delicious. I'm gonna give another bite here. well with our herbs and spices the potato is nice and soft with the lentil mixture inside this is part of the Bombay street food menu as well so this is a good option for a starter I think that's very very tasty I really enjoy that that is really fresh and it's cooked to order as well so this is the twisted box now Ladies and gentlemen, this box is actually smaller than it usually is. There's a lot of food in there. Normally it's 13 pounds. The box is normally a little bit bigger and there's a lot more chips in there. The reason why it's not as much chips in there um, as they usually have is because I've just removed a lot of food and I don't want to waste any food. So I kindly asked the owner just to cut down on the chips, but that is a lot of food. So I think it's great value for money and you also get a free drink with that as well. 
kicking off first with the masala fish bites. This is the masala fish marinated in their desi spices and the batter. It's got coated a bit of that tamarind sauce and chili sauce. Bismillah, let's give this a try. Cooked beautifully, nice and flaky. I love the flavouring of the batter. It's got some nice spices marinated into that. That is cooked with a lot of freshness. That is absolutely gorgeous. That is Dream Bucket certified. And just another try as well of this beautiful piece of haddock. It's absolutely gorgeous. I can taste a bit of that chilli, bit of the paprika flavour. That is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, that is lovely. Chunky chips now. Let's give it a try. Mmm. Really crunchy. Really soft in the inside. Nice and fluffy as well. Those chips are banging, man. This is really important because this is what they are, a fish and chips. And they've got to get the chips right. Moving on to the Naga Donna. Let's give this a try. Just a little bit of drop. I love the texture of the Naga. The Naga Donna. The Donna is nice and soft but it's also quite thick, meaty, really juicy. The naga sauce is nice and spicy. And I've got the caramelized onions on there as well, and the cooked peppers. This is really, really tasty, really delicious. I think that for me is definitely dual bucket serve. I'm not gassing here. I think this is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, this is just really, really tasty. I'm enjoying this so much. I'm kind of getting distracted as well because the food is that good that I just want to just sit down and eat it all. I do apologise Draw Bucket Gang. But that, ladies and gentlemen, this Nagadonna is Draw Bucket certified. Really spicy, really tasty. What Nagadonna is all about. Right, we're going to try out the sea kebab. Let's give this a try. Again, good quality meat. The herbs and spices, it's got a bit of a spicy kick into it, so there must be some chilies inside there. I love the charring on the outside, gives it a bit of a smoky flavour. Good quality ingredients, this is really tasty. Got an exclusive drink here, they even got their own little fruit punch pouches. Uh, this drink is the Twisted CFP Fruit Punch. Right, so let's try some of this fruit punch. This is their very own manufactured Twisted CFP Fruit Punch and it's halal as well. So let's give this a try. I'll tell you what, that is really lovely. Nice, cool, refreshing, fruity. It actually complements this, this type of food as well with all the spices. That is lovely, that is really refreshing, and I'm definitely gonna get loads of these pouches when we get to that bad boy summer season. We have got the fish, I've not got no chips, I've had enough chips. Chips are lovely, but it's all about the fish now. This is sustainable fish, it is haddock as well, it's cooked in vegetable oil, 100% halal. So let's give this a try. Cut into that. Look at that. Look at that steam coming out. Ooh, this looks really quality. First impressions, I have not tried this, but presentation wise, this is a quality piece of presentation we've got here. The batter is wrapped around that haddock nicely inside. It's not crumbly, it's not falling out of the place. My fingers aren't even that greasy. All I can feel is just that crispy batter slightly crumbling away from my fingertips. Let's give this a try, bismillah. First impressions, as I said again, everything is just wrapped so uniquely and so beautifully together. Nice and golden, very crispy. A bit into the batter and that haddock is so soft and juicy as well. Seasoned beautifully and that batter Oh my God, that batter is absolutely unique. I went up to the owner and I asked owner, Zach, what you got in that batter? He said, it's a family hidden secret. I'm not surprised. It must be some type of, he said it's from generations passed down as well. 
but that is absolutely delicious. The fish is nice and flaky and juicy. The batter is so crispy and it's held beautifully together and it's not even greasy at all. That's the best thing I love about it as well. This is seasoned to perfection, this is. Ladies and gentlemen, that is true bucket certified. Before we move on to the dessert, which is the milk cake, which I'm really looking forward to trying that out as well. They also, every Fridays from 4.30 to 10 p.m., they do a smash burger as well. They've got their own unique smash box as well, which has got the smash burger, donna meat, chicken bites and chips as well. Guys, give that a try as well if you're a big fan of smash burgers. Have a look at their Instagram page as well. They've got all of their menu and their unique Sunday dishes that they're going to release um, all on their Instagram, TikTok. Check them out, guys, all over their socials. I'll leave it in the link in the bio. So every week they have their own milk cake. This week they've got a bubblegum milk cake. It's not the usual flavor I usually go for for a milk cake, but let's give this a try. That is really fresh, really tasty. The cake is nice and creamy. I love the texture. Nice and sweet as well. It's got the bubblegum flavor. It's not the usual flavor I go for. But this is really, really tasty. And they've got a lot of other flavors every Sunday as well. This is a nice way to finish off the meal. Ladies and gentlemen, I think we've got a case here for the most elite fish and chip shop in Leeds, maybe even West Yorkshire. I'm not gonna lie, my first impression looking at the menu, I thought this place might be a jack of all trades, but my gosh, I have been proven wrong. This is absolutely fantastic from the foil fish, jerk chicken, lahori chicken and chips. These guys do it all, but they do it all with absolute quality. Just a reminder to keep an eye out for their Halal Bombay street food menu. These items are available every single day at Cardigan Fish Bar. Be aware the prices have changed and they will be having a new menu coming out very soon. Also, keep an eye out for their buy one get one free on small fish and chips and sausage and chips. 100% clean halal food cooked fresh to order. They are open Monday to Saturday, Cardigan Fish Bar, and on Sunday they become the Twisted CFB with their Twisted Menu. Thank you Jewel Bucket Gang for watching another Foodie Ants food review. If you enjoyed the review, please give the video a like and make sure you subscribe to the channel. Inshallah, we have many reviews coming up very soon. So Get your jewel buckets ready, because we're about to go in. Thank you for watching another Foodie Ants food review. Please follow the Instagram page, Foodie Ants. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe.